Hello everybody, here Renee from Spain again with a new video. Behind the camera I have, I have my daughter again and she's really happy to help me because because a lot of people oh sorry, because a lot of people really liked it at, uh, at the last video that she helped me because they say they say that I show the records a lot better like this. So it's great. Another thing I wanna say, more than two thousand people are subscribed to my channel. And I really, really appreciate everybody of you that subscribe to my channel. And it's amazing that in three years or in four years, yes, three or four years, I, I, I became, I don't know, became so popular. It's not the right way of saying it, but I became uh, a legend on YouTube. No, no. Um, that I'm happy that so many people like my videos, and that's what I wanted to say. That's why thank you, everybody. Do I look good, Claudia, on the, on the camera? <laughs> anyway, just very happy. Okay, I'm gonna stop with this now. I'm gonna show. I'm gonna do something special. Actually, uh, you all can can win something, but that will take Papa? some time Papa? because Papa? before I make Papa? that video, Papa? my 2,000 subscribers Papa? video. Papa? Yeah. Papa? Okay, so I'm gonna show now my Gary Moore. 12 inch vinyl collection not 7 inch uh, singles but I'm going to show all my vi LPs uh, and my maxi singles that I own by Gary Moore one of my favorite guitarists ever first the Back on the Streets album from 1978 so can I this? Mm. yes? Hey, yes there it is Yes. Okay. This album yeah, is to me one. No, it's okay. It's okay. This album is actually not a very strong album, in my opinion. Uh, the strongest songs are the Phil Lenot songs, the Thin Lizzy guy. For example, "Don't Believe a World," "A World War," "Fanatic Fascist," or uh, "Parisian Walkaways." They're all Lennox songs and I really like those songs but the, the, the Gary Moore songs like Song for Donna or What what Would You Rather Be or Wasp <laughs> those songs are doesn't make so much sense in my opinion okay that's why it's quite a weak album but the next album from 1982 is The Corridors of Power and I really love this record here we have Always Gonna Love You that I love, Don't Take Me For A Loser, amazing song, Falling In Love With You is an amazing song too, um, yeah, only amazing songs, also the lineup was great with Neil Murray and Ian Pace on drums, right? it was a great album, Corridors Of Power, can you see it? That I can see it, yeah. No, from that album I will show a maxi single, Falling In Love With You with two songs on the B side Papa. see also Papa. from 1983 yeah. Oh, yeah. oh yes it's true and then this is one of my favorite albums by Gary Moore Victims of the Future this oh, only yeah, got great Papa. songs Papa. on it and of course the very famous Empty Rooms ballad is also on here but later he re-recorded a few times. Yes. Yes. Okay. See? It's a great album with Neil Carter on keyboards and baking vocals. That guy was an amazing keyboard player. Okay. I show you some uh, maxi single also uh, from that album. Hold on to love. Also again with three songs on it. Papa, un poquito más abajo, un poquito más abajo, un poquito más abajo, echale un poquito. Like this? No, you can still see it? Yeah. But a little more up. Uh, yeah, a little more up. A little, a little more down again. Yes. Uh, okay. A little closer like this. Okay. And, and a little more yeah. up again. Yes. Oh, okay. Now. Good. Here we have an album that people don't really talk about. But uh, to me this album is amazing. It's actually <laughs> produced by Chris Tansagaris. 
uh, that's uh, that's the same guy that produced Anvil. <laughs> we talk about Dirty <laughs> Fingers. You see, and this album came actually out a year after this one. And here we have Hiroshima, oh. a great song, a nuclear attack, another great. Song. Okay, for turn around. Es que el gatito. Turn around. Turn the camera around. Filming yourself. Turn around. There's a turn more, more, more. Okay, thank you. No, it's really falling. No, no. Mm. <laughs> Claudia, you get. You should go away. Go away. Hey, yeah. Hey, sorry about this. Okay. Hey. <laughs> uh, okay, stop. Claudia, let me show some records. Dirty fingers. Okay, and this always reminds me the the, the sound a little bit by uh, Michael Schenker group from the early 80s. You know, they have a very similar sound, Gary Moore and Michael Schenker, in my opinion. <laughs> Here we have a re-recorded song by uh, by Gary Moore, Empty Rooms. This came out in 1985. They got four songs. Here we have Run For Cover, a great full-length album with so many great songs. And again, Empty Rooms is on here, re-recorded. This came out in 85. Here we have Wealth Frontiers. This is more it sounded more commercial, you know, especially the song Friday on my mind. They also own on Maxi Single. And this got three tracks on it. It's also kind of a rap version of Friday on my mind. Claudia, please, I'm showing <laughs> my Gary Moore collection. Claudia, don't do that. Come, please. Papa, it's Cassie. Yeah. I know we can show that uh, in a DVD collection uh, video. Claudia, nu alleen maar Gary Moore, Claudia. Geen Blu-rays, andere keer Blu-rays. Mm. Please. Look, this is a uh, Gary Moore again, of course. <laughs> a maxi single with four songs on it. Or five. No, four songs. Yeah. Five songs. Five songs on it. Sorry. Another one, this is all from uh, the Wealth Frontiers album, to promote the Wealth Frontiers. And here we have Over the Hills and Far Away, the song, uh, so Nightwish covered that song, you can check it out on, uh, uh, on, on YouTube. And also we have a great song on here, that never appeared on, on, on any Gary Moore album, it's Crying in the Shadows, it's also on here. Claudia, please, you show your collection in different moments. Here we have another album, After the War. And after this, Gary Moore also changed more into a blues style. I have nothing on vinyl from uh, from those days. Like uh, After Hour and, uh, and those records. But I will show them maybe in the future. But now I only want to show my vinyls, After the War. And here we have a couple of maxi singles. You see? From that album. Good. Quickly, I want to show a couple of things I own, and then I finish this video. Gary Moore, live, live, live in Stuttgart, 87, Papa. bootleg. Papa, it's okay, like I can be my video later when you finish you. Do you want to make your video? Yeah. Okay, I'll make your video later. Yes. See, the, the gold tour. It's a double vinyl. Here we have Gary Moore with G-Force. I think this came out in the early 80s, only this is a re-release from 87 on Victoria label, the Spanish label. Here we have, um, this is from, <laughs> this is from, let me see, I don't know when this, year, this came out exactly, but this is Gary Moore, see with, uh, with a couple of tracks, with Parisian walkways and this is actually the, the, an old lineup from Gary Moore but this was released in the in the 80s by the old record label when Gary Moore was very popular because of course then the old record label quickly released some stuff like for example this one they also released this one the old record company you know to make some some money same as this release it's a triple vinyl see also came out when Gary Moore was very popular there's a lot of the old songs of Gary Moore on here. And here we have an official live album, Live in Japan. 
See? And here we have, of course, Ian Pace on it, Neil Murray on here, and Don Array from Deep Purple fame, and uh, Elsie Osborne on keyboards. Great, great live album, actually, this is. Okay, this is everything I want to show. Thank you very much, Claudia. What happened there? Oh, we wijn al fell on the floor. Okay. <laughs> Say bye to the camera, Claudia. I always said bye bye. Yes. yes. Okay. Bye bye then. And now me. Yes. No? Okay, now I can make a video. You can show you a couple of your things. Show it now if you want to in this video. Show what you what you have there. Bye bye, Pedro. Bye bye, Pedro. Yeah. Um, yeah, video. No, the same video. No. No, but tengo que prepararlo. Ah, ah, vale, vale. Vale, pues lo dejamos, eh? Entonces ya, hacemos el video luego. Adiós. Okay, this was my video with my daughter. Take care everybody. And stay metal.